We begin with a tough takedown you will only see here on Local 10. A suspect telling police he wanted them to shoot and kill him. Local 10's Christian De La Rosa is live in Miami Beach with the exclusive tonight. Christian. Well, police say this all started when a couple from Brooklyn, New York, started fighting over an infidelity. It ended with police pulling out their weapons, pointing them at the man. They were ready to shoot. The cell phone video obtained by the one and only shows police responding to a 911 call of an armed man fighting a woman on Collins and 18th Street in Miami Beach. Police pointing their weapons at this man, his girlfriend getting in the way of an officer. The man reportedly shouting he wants a police officer to shoot and kill him. Police say his hands are under his shirt and he's refusing their commands to get down. One officer bravely running towards him, another one follows. The suspected armed man still resisting until they finally force him to the ground. He continues to defy officers who then use force, beating the man until he eventually gives up. As the man is on the ground and in handcuffs, police say he is still telling them he wants to be shot and killed by a cop. That's when Miami Beach police decide they're not taking him to jail. They Baker acted him, sent him to the hospital for a mental evaluation. A spokesperson for the Miami Beach Police Department telling Local 10 News, initial review of the report shows the officers displayed excellent restraint and showed compassion for someone with a possible mental illness. And that man identified as 24-year-old Jarvis Chapman. Police told us he ended up not being armed. I spoke to his girlfriend on the phone who tells me it was Chapman who called 911. Live in Miami Beach, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10 News. So disturbing. Christian, thank you.